Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hopefully everyone's doing well. So I just got back from grocery shopping. Oh, oh, it's raining, it's still raining. So I'm a bit annoyed. I tied my hair out by the way, I didn't cut it. It looks weird, doesn't it? Anyway. So today I want to try this coffee dripper from Daiso and also this one. So this one is a cup and this one is uh, just a, a, a disposable one I think. And I also got coffee filters. And to test I got this grounded coffee from Kohl's. Um, $5 less. And I'm into coffee these days because I basically have binged this guy's YouTube channel called, I don't know, some, something Hoffman. I'll put a link onto his channel down below. Like, he's a, a barista championship winner. So he's pretty into coffee, like niche coffee channel. Anyway, um... I'm still not a coffee expert, but apparently I bought the wrong thing. I should have bought like a bean ones rather than a grounded one, but I already bought it. So let's unpack these ones. So let's try this one first. So this one comes with a coffee spoon. So let's open it up. So let's open this. It looks very nice, doesn't it? It's very pretty. So I don't have a particular cup that a uh, special cup, so I'm just gonna use my regular cup so that fits. And I'm gonna wash it before I do that. Is there any special? Do not expose continental to direct fire. Do not put it near to fire or over. Okay, so this one, I'm just going to open it, it's going to cut it, usually it has this opening right here, if I have my, okay it doesn't, I'm going to cut it, and this is just, so everything is $2.80, so let's check it out. So update, um, I'm struggling to use this, I don't know how to use it actually. So I basically ruined two and I recorded the whole thing but I'm like I don't think I'm gonna show you why or how I ruined it. But this one, I, I'm right now I'm figuring out how to use it. Apparently there is a line here that I couldn't see before but now I can see. So now I have seeing these I can do that and then from the instruction it says uh, put the coffee dripper onto a cup and push and spread the filter downward so after doing that I guess this is I don't recommend it at all okay so I think it goes like that and then I'm going to open the coffee now. Oh. So there is a coffee there. I feel that's too big. So I'm going to use that little one. And then I'm going 
to put that coffee on top of these and we're going to try to this is very not steady at all so i put coffee there and i have put it on top of my cup okay so let's see if this is going to work i hear a sound it is going in okay so it kind of works But I ruined two before I finally figure out how to kind of use it. It's supposed to be easy. Look at that. That's the dis uh, instruction. But is it me? I feel probably it's me. But at the same time, I don't want to put myself there. So, okay. So, let's see whether it goes in. Okay, so it's actually pretty simple. You just have to fold it. I just couldn't figure out where the fold was, but the fold was very thin line here, here. So it's not that obvious. So you have to find it. So I couldn't find it before. So that's why I ruined two, but there is a little fold here, there. So you have to fold it right near the opening. It goes, it's, it, it's a bit oval, it's like that. So if you can see that faint line, you, you fold there. I ruined two pockets because I couldn't find it. See, I ruined two. <laughs> uh. So now I figured out how to use it. It's not a bad design, I guess, but I still, I guess I don't like the fact that I have to work really hard for it. So we're gonna let it sit for a little bit, this one, and we're gonna try that one now. So we are going to use one of this filter. I know this is a messy guys, I know this is very messy, I am fully aware of how messy this video is. Maybe it is an illustration of my, maybe it's definitely a a good um, insight to my mind <laughs> okay so what I'm gonna do I think I'm going to wet this also I don't have any spare cup so I'm gonna use my towel mug so what I'm going to do I'm going to wet I'm gonna wet this first Ooh, look at that drip 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 okay so I'm going to chuck that water out which is also it says unbleach I don't know whether there is a difference between unbleach and non bleach paper again I am NOT a coffee expert I don't do this usually and i don't know what the difference will be when we use okay so i think that should be enough i feel like i'm overusing coffee but at the same time they are giving me this really huge scoop of coffee so i'm thinking is it supposed to be a large scoop am i under dozing So I think this one is definitely much more convenient but I don't know what I'm doing so if you are like a coffee expert don't come at me you're doing it wrong I am probably am doing it wrong okay. 
Am I, do I need to add more coffee? <laughs> I feel like, what am I doing with my life? So this whole thing is a disaster, I feel. I feel it's a disaster. Do you feel it's a disaster? I feel it's a disaster. We are going to try the one that we were waiting for before. Guys, how are you doing? Are you guys doing okay? Yes, I'm asking because I'm selfish. Because I feel I'm not doing as great. That's why I'm asking you. Because as a woman, apparently, I still have this passive aggressive thing. I don't know why I don't like being in the center of this thing. It's a mess down here, by the way. Okay, so this one is has sat there for a little bit. And I have extracted really little tiny one of coffee. Definitely not a lot. So just really little tiny one. And we are going to try this and see whether it tastes good or not. So this is the ground that I bought from Coles. I just picked something that wasn't like too expensive. I think it was half price, but it doesn't look like it's a generic brand from Kohl's, so. I don't know, it's very mild. I can't taste any, what does it say? Deliver notes of honey and almond and raspberry. I cannot taste any almond or honey or raspberry. I can smell it different, like the smell is different, but the taste nor So that's from the coffee dripper. Maybe I put it, I need to put more, maybe. Okay, so. So this one I put more. So I also extracted very little. I quite like how clean it came out actually. It's quite clean. So this one is for the coffee dripper. It tastes different. It tastes better than this one. I mean like I still can't taste the honey and the almond and the raspberry but it tastes different. It tastes better on this one. Than on this one. From what I learned so far, I understood that the fact that there is a lot of aspects that you need to consider when you are making coffee, the temperature of the water, the, um, you know, the amount of um, coffee that you put, the grind of the coffee, the roast type, like a lot of things to consider. So I'm fully aware that those will contribute to the taste of the coffee, but I'm not experienced enough to know how to put together the combination the right combination to make the coffee great or to pick the right coffee or the right ground or the right like i don't want to invest 80 dollars 100 dollars for um a machine for coffee i think that i think the rain really gets to me right now I really like it in, in, in this dripper. It feels better. <laughs> Very subjective, totally not objective at all. It just like tastes better. It feels better. 
It's a lot smoother. Yes, I can taste the smoothness actually. Surprising. Yeah, with this strip, I want to drink more. With this one, it just tastes like instant coffee. That's so weird. So same beans, same water temperature. The only difference is the filter. So I prefer to drink from the filter drip ones. So that will cost you five sixty. The filter cup is two dollars eighty, and the paper cups uh, bundle is two dollars eighty. Well, this one is two dollars eighty on its own from Daiso. Yeah. <sighs> That's it guys. It's a mess. You want to see how much messy it is? It's a mess that you couldn't see. <laughs> also, this is the ground that I'm using. Uh, uh, uh. If you're in Australia, I guess you can see. So yeah, so that's, I, I would recommend it actually because I have difficulty using that. I spent like, I don't know, six minutes on it. So rather than leaving you with a bad taste for this vlog or for this review, I'm gonna leave you with this. This is the sound of rain of Sydney. It sounds good. <laughs> also, I'm still leaving my plants outdoor because I wanted to soak rainwater. <sighs> I kind of miss them though. I want them back inside, but I want just to leave them outside until the rain stops, which is, I don't know, it's probably from the forecast, it's going to be a full week, maybe next week, uh, the rain will stop. So I don't know. Sydney will be raining all week. Anyway. Cranky Cranky Val is signing out. <laughs> Bye everyone. <laughs>